All right, tell us about this place. Yeah, this place originally was used for having the elephant grass for the cattle. Mm -hmm. But we saw that we needed to boost the food security. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have decided to plant here. Oh, we are going to plant mm -hmm. banana plantation mm -hmm. uh, with uh, some fruits like mm -hmm. purples, mm -hmm. sugar cane around the fence mm -hmm. so that the children get what to eat. Okay. And avocado. So this will be bananas intercropped with good crops. Okay. Mm. And this side also is having bananas. Yeah. Okay. Now banana is one of the most preferred food here. Yes. So we are trying to have much banana so that our children can have. Yeah. And as you see now we have planted mm -hmm. pineapple as and the nuts. Mm -hmm. Normally the principle is when FWS, these people from yeah. Australia, yeah. from a culture across borders came, they are trying to teach us the principles in which we care for our land as we, mm -hmm. as, uh, we promote food production. And therefore when we are choosing what to plant, normally we are very cautious about what we are planting. Mm -hmm. And normally we are guided by three principles. One is uh, usefulness to companionship mm -hmm. whether the two plants you are planting mm -hmm. you are using they are companion to each other mm -hmm. and lastly we are using also the principle of stacking to have as much as possible from okay. a small piece of land so here we are having give plant uh, guinnets mm -hmm. so that they can fix the nitrogen yeah but they at the end we are also having guinnets for the children. Right. We are expecting also to have bananas, and with time we shall be having uh, ficus trees on which we Bikes. shall have we shall have the passion uh, passion, passion fruit, fruit vines, mm -hmm. and all those ones will enhance the production. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's uh, the the Western concept is crop rotation. For uh, where you rotate the crops for ones that are nitrogen fix fixers like peanuts, yeah, but which are really now good. with permaculture and like uh, yeah. uh, crop rotation because with crop rotation you change after season, yeah. But here mm -hmm. they may be there, like when you see these, uh, these are regiminous plants, mm -hmm. when they are there, they keep on fixing nitrogen, yeah. then as you produce, then the other one recycle the nitrogen, okay. So, we are not crop rotating, so, only that now it is starting. Ah, so so what you're doing is it dynamically, in other words, yeah. in other words, in a, in a form that uh, is continual rather than actually have to physically rotate the whole yes. thing because you're planting enough of them close enough together to be compatible in in in, in a sustainable manner. Yes. All right. Absolutely. That's a very good explanation of it. Mm, yeah.